Hi everyone, welcome to another Terry Talk. This week's topic, growth. Less about how hard you work than it is about how well you learn. Interesting point of view. You know, it's it's seemingly now that learning and science and having an understanding of things and even questioning things is kind of poo-pooed. It's not for the cool kids anymore. Uh, it's all seemingly really bad. Don't question things. Don't try to understand things. Don't try to get under the hood of things. But yet these are all the very things that are critical to our continued evolution. Adam Grant, his latest book called Hidden Potential, talks about the Protestant Reformation and how Luther uh, had uh, taken um, sort of opposition, if you will, to the Catholic Church. The Catholic Church would recite the Bible to people. Luther insisted that people read the Bible. In order to read the Bible, you need to learn how to read. And so when you actually look at the prosperity that comes out of the Protestant Reformation, it's less about the Protestant work ethic as it is about the ability to learn. Much more having to do with learning than hard work. That's kind of interesting. So when we're learning, if, if learning is about feeding your own ego, you're probably not turning on the learning centers of your brain. If it's fueling growth, you're probably moving ahead. But if it's all reactive and it's all ego, you're short circuiting learning. It keeps you in a protective bubble. It, it limits your access to new information and you reject anything that comes along that threatens your image. As, as Adam Grant talks in his book, thin skin, thick skulls. Remind you of anybody? And then those of us that get negative feedback, if we've always take negative feedback as a way to kind of push it aside and protect the ego and weed it out, that just reinforces outdated thinking. Thank goodness we have people that have moved beyond that over the years. So the thing about learning is it's primarily intellectually, um, it's intellectual behaviorally, um, but the experience, the experience of it is emotional and it's that emotional experience of learning that stops us from doing that very thing however as we know little pain gets a lot of gain and not that we want to make learning uncomfortable but sometimes it is and discomfort is natural and real and necessary so growth learning growth is about expanding your knowledge becoming really really curious when did we stop being curious? Somewhere along the way, we did. And in our next Terry Talk next week, we're going to get under the hood of that one to find out a little bit more about the power of curiosity and how that can also help expand our learning.